St. Louis County apartment residents are told their flooded belongings were not worth saving. The unbelievable response given to Fox Files investigator Chris Hayes when he checked out complaints of unlivable conditions. A bizarre episode unfolded right in front of us as we pulled up to this apartment complex right behind the Breckenridge Hills Police Department. Tenants sparring over conditions with apartment staff at a 24 unit complex. A police officer checks in while one worker starts recording us with his cell phone and then walks away. Are you uh, affiliated with this apartment complex? I'm not sure who you are. Residents in tears over their living conditions. Our rent's paid. We have a son. You know, it's just not right for somebody to be able to control stuff like that. We're doing what we're supposed to do. She claims many have not had air conditioning or hot water since the July flood filled their basements with several feet of water. I don't know. I don't know who to call. She said she pays rent to a holding company and is being evicted for talking to me about their living conditions. St. Louis County Public Works showed up to investigate and inspect are posting violations on almost every door. No valid permit, no licensed plumber. <laughs> One of the apartment workers said he had the authority to answer our questions. You're one of the owners? No, no, no comment. Only giving the name Jason, he blames the tenants. There's no mold. All their junk that was in the basement for years that was no good in the first place was removed. Who are you to call it junk? Um, because they called it junk. How do we know it's not family photos? I had picture albums from when I was in college that I cut around. We had tons of stuff down there. She's salvaging what she can, saying she did just get her air conditioning repaired. Jason said it'll be at least a week before one tenant gets her hot water back. We'll stay on top of the county's investigation. For the Fox Files, I'm Chris Hayes.